Um, and now I'd like to introduce Wilford Welsh, my partner. And Wilford is a force of nature. Those of you who know Wilford can attest to that. Um, Wilford is, among other things, a former US diplomat, publisher, economic development consultant, professor of international business management, and author of the recently published book, In Our Hands, a handbook for intergenerational actions to solve the climate crisis. Uh, we have also benefited, every single one of us, every day of our lives, immensely from fossil fuels. Okay? We benefited in terms of the production of the cars and the fueling of the cars that we use. We benefited from the planes we fly on. We benefited from the buildings with all that cement with the electricity it is created by the gas. We benefited from the oil. We benefited from the plastics that uh, have made our lives convenient. That's very hard to get off of. As we all know, we've got to get it off of right now. I mean, this time has come and gone, and it's killing us. I know you know all of that, uh, but I want to stress it because we've got to figure out a way of getting off that as fast as we can. I see global warming as really like, a, in my mind, it's like a freight train is coming directly at us. And we're not paying attention because we're so focused on all the other noise that is going on in our world. Okay? So we've got to figure out a way of doing that. Thank you, Carl. We've got to figure out a way of getting off of that very, very fast. So we have to be really innovative on the ways that that may be possible. Now, Sarah mentioned to me Buckminster Fuller. She said, ask me whether I knew him. I said, yeah, I did something with him in Hawaii. He got to China 100 years ago. Mm -hmm. So I'm going to give you a Buckminster quote. And that Bucky Fuller quote is, you never change things by fighting against the existing reality. To change something, build a new model that makes the old model obsolete. And that's what we're talking about. Incrementalism doesn't work today. Uh, we have to be very, very bold. We have to think of new ideas like intergenerational collaboration to solve the climate crisis.